Guys, if you do these things and you make sure you do these things with every woman that you come in contact with, women would even admit this. They always come back. Now, I'm being honest with y'all. I'm not adding or taking away as if I was preaching from the Bible. You shouldn't add or take away from the Bible. So I would not say nothing that's false. Listen, I have a female on the way right now. She might just walk through the door while I'm making the video. I don't know. I don't care. But listen, I done had girls that done came back the next day, the next week, the next month. But listen, I done had girls come back three years. The longest that it ever took a girl to come back was 17 years. I know y'all thinking, how you know 17 years? This girl told me 17 years ago, I gave her the best sex ever. Me and her are grown. I got about four kids. She got about four kids. She married. I forgot she exists. We moved to different states. She told me, she said, I still haven't forgot that dick from 17 years ago. I said, word. She said, where are you at? I said, do you still look like you used to look? She said, even better. She sent me pictures. She's coming off of these things that I tell you guys. This is why she said she's coming. And I make sure I do this with every girl I come in contact with. Every one of them. And these are her words, not mine. And y'all might see her walk through the door Matter of fact, hold on, I need to be checking my phone. Hold up. Nah, that ain't her, hold on. Okay. A lot of girls on my line, but that ain't her, but she might walk in, so she might interrupt the video, but that ain't important. I'm here to tell you guys, listen to me. If you do these things right here, I guarantee you, she will come back. Number one, pass her test. Every girl that come to see you, cause guys, don't go see them. Girls be lying. They be having crazy exes that you gonna have to lay down. I swear to God, I done been in so many situations that the girl ain't fucked with somebody in years and the door got kicked. And I got to shut up because I got so many felonies behind women. And all I've been doing was protecting myself. But anyway, that's a whole nother story. A whole nother video for a whole nother day. But to get back on track. Alright guys, listen. This girl told me. I remember how you smelled. Y'all know I just dropped the video today about the Gucci, the Dior, the Burberry, and uh, the Million cologne that I wear. She said, I still remember your smell. She said, I remember you the only guy that ever just made me laugh and happy. But I felt protected. I'm like, okay, she married. Why is she saying all of this? She was like, then you gave me the best dick ever. You didn't text me afterwards. You didn't bother me. You didn't even pay me no attention. That shit turned me the fuck on. And I got married. I've been thinking about you this whole time. Y'all, I forgot this girl existed. Every year for 17 years, this girl been thinking about my dick. And y'all, I'm going to tell you what I just done. I just done this before this girl walked through the door. And I do this with every woman. Every woman is the same, but every woman different. So I treat every woman accordingly. And that means I say less. So I'm going to tell y'all right now, break down to you guys exactly what I do to make women obsessed. And Lord, forgive me for this. I'm talking about the baddest bitches in the world. I'm talking about basketball players, NFL players, 
rappers, the biggest dope boys, their girlfriends, their wives, they're busting it. Why these guys are playing basketball or these guys are doing a profession or these guys are out doing something. I'm blowing a girl's legs out. You dig what I'm saying? And shh, they know I never say nothing. But with that said, all right, this is exactly what I done yesterday when I smashed the snow bunny. This is exactly what I'm gonna do when I smash this caramel girl. And this is exactly what I did with the Puerto Rican girl y'all saw on the channel last week. Y'all check my shorts. This is the same thing that I done with the half black, half white, and uh, whatever. I, man, these girls be mixed up. I don't know. But anyway, let's get straight to it. I do this. This is my routine. So let's just call this the make them obsessed routine. Guys, it sounds simple but it matters. I literally take my own clippers. I shake myself up, right? It matters. I take beard cream. I put beard cream in there. When a girl hug you, when she smell your beard and it smell good, that make her pussy wet. Don't y'all miss a step, write this down. Brush your teeth. Good. Floss good. Girls love to tell you. Boy, your breath smells so good. That smells so good. Bro, just do like this. We ain't doing no eyebrow arching. Just make sure you ain't got nothing in between there. Take your chapstick. Make sure you ain't got no excess nothing. Think about if you looked at a girl, I don't care how sexy she is, if she got metal right there, boogers and up, make sure you are fresh, right? She's finna walk through the door just the way I am. Alright? So this is what I done. Went and took a nice long shower with my special shower gel, with my dove soap, with my body wash. After I got out the shower, I took the mango dreadlock stuff why because most girls like to pull your hair and take your hair down if you don't got hair put some good smelling stuff in your waves brother make your bald head shine whatever brother listen they smell that hair oh man then you take a break make sure your house is spotless hopefully you got your own everything make sure your house is spotless Make sure it is spotless. Make sure it smells good. Make sure, hold on. Make sure that you got the air freshener. So you smelling good. Your house smelling good. Come on now. Make sure you got the air fresheners. Make sure you got the air fresheners, gang. Y'all love me. Y'all love me. I love y'all too. I love y'all too. I got the check. See this girl walking through the door. So anyway, all right. So, no bullshit. Now, you looking good, you smelling good. That matters. So this girl already damn near hypnotized. But this even before she get here because I'm rushing. All right. So anyway, now, your body smelling good. The same shit you put on your beard, put on your private area, right? Do not put on no regular draws. Guys, look, this is what you do. Go get you some ethical boxes. Get you some ethical boxes. That's it. That matters. I'm telling you, girls love that. Once you do that, right here, skeet right here. Because if she give you some head, that's going to matter. I'm telling you. All she do is smell good. All right? I'm going to walk y'all through this. Just pay attention. I got y'all. So, your boxes matter. Make sure you put lotion on. Now your skin smell good. Right? This is how you take your cologne, you guys. Too much cologne going to make the bitch not be able to breathe. Listen. 
Not enough, she ain't gonna recognize it. But perfect is gonna make perfect. You take a ski, right? Fuck that. Hold on, I'm gonna show y'all. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. Fuck it. All right, I grabbed the million, right? You take a ski, right here, guys. One ski. You rub it on your wrist. Wrist to wrist. Hit your neck, because the girl's going to kiss and suck on your neck. After you do that, take this, rub it together again, put it down there by your midsection. Then you take one ski here, let it marinate, and put one ski in the midst over here. Boom. I'm 6'6". Six, six. I put mine right here because when she hugged you, this is where her head is on me, on me. If you're shorter than me, put it up here. The whole point is for her to smell you. All right? So, now you're smelling good. You're looking good. You're clean. The house clean. It's all matter, you guys. All right. Now, make sure you have cold waters in your refrigerator. Make sure that you have cold waters in your refrigerator. And a soda. And make sure you have selected juices. Because girls get thirsty. If she smoke and you a smoker, I'm a pothead. I'm already going to have three or four rolled up. And when we smoke them, I'm going to have plenty for her to roll up. And going to give her something to take home. I don't drink, but if she a drinker, I'm going to get what she want. Y'all think I'm playing? Y'all think I'm playing? Hold up. <clears throat> oh. Baby, give me some Patron. I drank Patron. I drank Patron. Y'all, I'm telling you how to make them come back even 17 years later now. Pay attention, man. Pay attention. I'm giving y'all a game. I'm giving y'all a game. I'm coming back. 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 All right. So now, so now, everything's together. So you already prepared. So you make sure you got your condom. Make sure you go to the store, get you a honey, get you a rhino. Get you some little sex enhancement pill, especially if it's your first time smashing them, right? Go ahead and take a couple of Motrin's, Tylenol with it, because you're going to catch a headache. But your dick going to be like dead. Right? Pay attention to me now. Y'all, I promise you, I done had girls that told me I hate you because they done caught me cheating. I done had girls tell me that nigga, you done took money from me and never paid me back. I done had girls tell me I done fucked their sister, their cousin. And every one of them, they came back for more dick. I promise you, when you lay the pipe like this, it's all about the foreplay. All about the foreplay, guys. And, and y'all, I'm about tired of this. I'm doing this. If it's seven days in a week, this is five days a week for me, man. I'm just being honest. But I do this for content for y'all. Like, really, a girl finna walk through the door. I'm trying to hurry up and do the video for, you know... So y'all won't see the bitch. And of course, you know, I, I barely put my bitches' faces on camera. But if you want to see how my bitches look, check my shorts. Also, pinned up in the comment section is my TikTok. And, uh, hold on. Hello? Oh, uh, nah, shit. What's good? You out there? You what? Uh, well, I'm 
come here and you say you're gonna pull in. I bet I am I bet the door or some shit. Uh. Well anyway, y'all see I named her sloppy. Sloppy, I can't make this up. Five minutes away, she just called. So anyway, I'm not making this up. So anyway, I got to hurry this up, y'all. I got to hurry this up. So anyway, um, so uh, after you do all of that, when you get her to the crib, she going to be impressed. She going to be uh, turned on. Um, you smelling good. You looking good. You shaped up. Um, always make sure you got on something decent. This is a new shirt. You know what I'm saying? I got on the ethical boxers, boxers and nice socks. Uh, make them feel comfortable. Make sure they got something to drink. Make sure that they, they just happy. Um, never complain. They're going to take you to Texas. They're going to say little stuff like the niggas look. They're going to take you through Texas. Just ignore it. Just make the best out of it. And if you understand this one thing for this girl walking here, understand this one thing before I let y'all go. I'm going to try to let y'all see her ass. So y'all wait till the end of the video. And right, she had a fat ass or not. But anyway, before I end this video, guys, remember, that's her pussy. Just have fun while you got her. See, you guys be with a girl and you be thinking about the past and the future. Just worry about the present. Don't worry about what she doing tomorrow or yesterday or when she ain't with you. Just enjoy her now. But let me see if she had the dough. Y'all hold on. Yeah, yeah, I think I see that pretty car pulling up. I'm finna see can I get an ass as soon as she walked through the door. I'ma see can I get over here and see her ass. See, I'm rude. Ladies don't think I'm too rude. I'm just gonna tell her, put that ass in the camera, let me see it right quick. But I'ma see how she looking. It been 17 years, gang. But I'm trying to tell y'all that's how it go. But it been 17 years. They always come back if you do this. Now y'all, I don't have no clue why this bitch is just sitting in the fucking car. I don't know what the fuck she's doing. I should have put on my other chains. And guys, always make sure you keep a rubber on you. But get this Trojan. Fuck a Magnum. A Magnum don't do it. This brain fire. It make her extra wet. It got extra shit on it. Get this rubber. I'm trying to tell y'all. Trying to tell y'all, but hold on. Let me see. See y'all the women the same way. I can see her through my cameras, right? She putting on her perfume. She doing like this. She put on her stuff. The women on the same type of time. Trying to tell y'all. Hold on. Hold on, hold on. And then look y'all. Make sure you always keep your damn room clean as fuck. Make sure you always keep your shit clean as fuck. Hold on, y'all. Don't get off the video. Make sure I got my shit right. Hold on, I got y'all. Hold on. Let's see what she looking like. Girl, it take you so long to get out that car. The fuck you be doing? What you be doing? Spraying on your perfume and shit? Uh, I just lost a whole blunt in my car, and I don't even know what the You lost a blunt? Is. Oh, we got to find that. They were You what? They were happy. Oh, happy. Happy, but no shit. You know you got that sack on you anyway, don't you? 
You got that sack on you or no? You know I got it if you ain't got it. Oh boy, let me see. What? Let me see. I need me some new gas anyway. No, no, you don't. You don't need my shit. I buy it from you. Nuh-uh. You I can't buy your shit? Hell no. I need this shit. Oh, I smoke my same shit. What you got on? I don't know. Oh, shit. Okay.